In this part of the free Blender in Blender course, we are going to light a kitchen. So let's get started straight away. We have made our assets, we have made the kitchen, we have made a smoothie and everything is done for this render. So we only have to light it to make it look a bit better. So right now I have an HDRI right here. I'm not going to change it at all. I think it's fine. So it's the Sunset JHB Central and this is the way the setup looks like. So it's basically a cube and we've got one hole right over here and the HDRI is shining its light through this side and it's going to be pretty powerful. So I set the sky strength to 13.7. So let's see what happens if we place this on one. You're way too dark, you get a lot of noise and that is because there's some light bounces going on in the cube itself, but it won't be enough if you don't crank up the strength. So I'm going to set it to 13.7 and I think this looks fine. So now we have this edge light coming from the side and it already looks pretty good, but it could be a bit better. So this is what I tested around and I just think this looks a little bit better. So I'm going right here into the asset browser and I'm going to use the ultimate gobo pack, which is a light textures pack I made myself and it's on Gumroad or Blender Market. If you do not have the ultimate gobo pack, I recommend getting it because it will upgrade your lighting game for the rest of your life but what you can also do is go to the other video called how to use gobos in blender the ultimate guide and in the end of that video i will explain how to make this square shaped light so you can follow along just fine just follow that tutorial first come back and you won't have all the assets that i'm going to be using right now but you will be a long way and first i'm going over to windows and there's a lot of them there's windows with animated trees there's windows still i'm going to use the windows still only windows and then we have all of this and i'm going to use window 3 which is a window with the arch i think it's a very cool model so i'm just going to use that one i'm going to drag it into the scene r x 90 have it face towards the wall like that g and x bring it over to that side r and z let's rotate it just a little bit to have it skewed a bit g z z let's have it move backwards a bit g x and i will place it somewhere over there to get a cool looking result i'm also going to increase the radius because now it's pretty hard and we can increase it to 0 0.013 and that looks a little bit softer and i think that's quite nice we can also add a black body note right over here so add a black body and now change the temperature to 8355 and that's the way i'm going to use this gobo now i'm going to add another one i want to add window four so let's drag this in here and i'm going to place it on the wall like that G and Y, let's bring it outwards, something like this, maybe a bit more to the side. And we can also increase the radius of this to make it look a bit softer. And I also want to add the black body node right over here, set it to 8,355, make sure it's the same color as the other one. And now this looks pretty cool, but there's one light missing and that's the one that's going to be right over here. So I'm going to take this same light, place it right over here, R, Y, and now it will be faced on the table like this. Let's see what it adds. Just a little bit more texture on the table. I think that looks nice, but we can also increase the scale of this. So let's go to the shader editor and maybe increase it a bit like so by bringing this value down. Something like this should look pretty cool. So let's turn that off. Okay, very nice. Let's turn this one off and that one off. So this is what we had before and now we have this. So that's the way to increase the quality of your lighting in a matter of seconds. If you do have the ultimate Gobo pack, play around with some different styles and see what you like the most. I think this works pretty fine for my render, so I'm going to use this. Once again, you can get the ultimate Gobo pack on Gumroad, Blender Market or Patreon. In the next part of this free course, we are going to make another product animation. So buckle up and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching. And if you're interested in getting the ultimate Gobo pack, you can get it on Blender Market or Gumroad. Link is in the description. In the next video of this free course, we are going to make this shot. So I hope you're excited and I'll see you there.